Hello, I'm Brent Lubert with Big Muddy Urban Farm, uh, Executive Director, and we're in Omaha, Nebraska. We're at uh, the Community Garden in Gifford Park, uh, which houses the Youth Garden uh, behind me here. And uh, Big Muddy Urban Farm is integral to the, the Youth Garden programming uh, during the summer. There's also a residency program where uh, young people 19 to 28 uh, spend a year in two houses in the neighborhood. They put together a business plan uh, and start to select crops and really go through the decision-making parts of building a business, a farm business, and then they put that into action on five lots in the neighborhood. The residents kind of figure out how to do marketing for the CSA program, how to retain uh, customer information. So some of the produce goes to that. Then we're also selling at the farmer's market that's in the neighborhood. Uh, and sometimes uh, there's an occasional restaurant sale in there too. So with the Sarah Youth Educator Grant uh, that we applied for, uh, that helped us with incorporating residents into the youth garden programming. So uh, the residents, not only are they putting the business together, they're also learning how to teach that to uh, a group of 30 youth gardeners ages 3 to 13. Also part of the Sarah Youth Educator Grant, we were able to take the kids, get out of the city environment and uh, go to Honey Creek Creamery, uh, which is a goat farm about 20 minutes away. For a majority of the kids, they've not been to a farm. Um, and so this was their first experience being on a farm. They were also able to milk goats. Uh, there's a dairy processing facility over at that farm and so able to kind of see the process. And uh, we went on a hike as well and went to the top of this bluff and kind of looked out over the agricultural landscape and uh, natural landscape. Um, so it was, it was definitely a really good experience for the kids. I think urban agriculture is vitally important uh, for shaping our food system. It provides an education. Uh, so when you're out there working on the plot in a neighborhood, uh, there's many people walking by and they're wondering what's going on, uh, what you're doing, uh, and, and those kind of questions, which then as a urban farmer, you're able to kind of talk about the soil, uh, you're able to talk about the plants that you're growing um, and being able to provide that like source information of what it's like uh, to grow crops, uh, the pest issues, the, uh, the soil fertility process, um, you know, all these different things that then can, as an urban consumer, can impact them and start to uh, be able to have discussions on a on a larger, uh, larger wavelength on what's going on with soil and uh, how can we shape our food system democratically with many voices uh, getting to uh, a better outcome.